The PA National Guard hosted local firefighters in Fort Indian Town Gap tonight, teaching them about the numerous military helicopters on base. It's part of ongoing safety training for firefighters. Fox 43's Matt Kleindance explains why the training is so important. On Wednesday, over 100 firefighters throughout Central PA gathered at Fort Indian Town Gap for emergency training, each one learning about the different military helicopters that fly from the base. They're going through four stations, which include an orientation to the CH-47 Chinook, the UH-60 Blackhawk, and then the UH-72 Lakota. Aviation Safety Officer Danielle Watkins says this is the first time local fire departments were brought on base for this kind of training. We brought them here just to kind of start building a relationship and rapport with them to talk about the things that are important to know. The goal of the program is to get fire crews familiar with these complex military helicopters so they know what to do in the case of an emergency. Their goal obviously is life-saving measures and wanting to help as much as possible but also our responsibility to educate them to protect their safety too when they arrive so they know some things to watch out for. So this is a good opportunity for the locals who don't get a chance to see this type of aircraft. Chief Donald Wilson from the Fort Indian Town Gap Fire Department says the basic training will hopefully get firefighters interested in more advanced military helicopter safety training. Maybe what their appetite where they want to get some more training on it, more in-depth training. And there are a few places in the country that do offer more in-depth training. Colonel Tim Zerby says the training will also help members of the PA National Guard better do their jobs. We are citizen soldiers. We live among and are very proud that we're from and live with the community. Their understanding and our transparency uh, with them is critical to us continuing a great partnership and relationship serving the community, uh, the Commonwealth, and even the nation. Matt Kleindens, Fox 43 News.